Hi everybody, today I'll show you how to make booklet in Canva. So let's begin. Alright, so as you can see here that we are inside the dashboard of the Canva. And to make the booklet, what we need to do, we actually need to search for the booklet template. Since we don't want to build it from the scratch. So you can simply write down booklet. And you will be able to see Canva template. And now I'll simply click on booklet. Now you will be able to see the different templates for the booklet here that we can use directly. Obviously some of them are actually part of pro version so we can't use that. Other than that uh, we can use the free ones. Okay so I think I have found the good ones here. This one is looking good and this one is also looking good. Let's just explore some of the other booklets. Alright so I think I can go here with this one. So let's click on that. And what we can do, you can also see the relative booklets as well. So if you want to go with any of these, you can simply go. But I think I'm going to go with this one. So let's click on customize this template. And we'll be jumping into Canva design. Now what we need to do, we just simply need to customize this based on our requirements. Or based on our company. Alright, so there is a one problem with this template that it only has a single page. So I think I'm going to change this one. So maybe I'm going to go here with this one. So let's click on apply all pages. Yeah, I think now this is looking great. So now we have the complete booklet template here. You can see here, we have this complete design of the 13 different pages. We can customize all of these detail based on our requirement or based on our company data. So I'm going to try to customize the first page here. So let's assume here that what we're going to do, we're going to write down uh the name of the company we can use the word that we have in the logo all right so i think we have added the text so i need to add some space here now this is looking great and in a similar way what we can do we can change the image here and we can also change the logo here so if you wanted to change the logo so i'm pretty much okay with the logo but i can change the color theme of this so we're gonna go here the blue color a light blue color uh we can go here with the purple color as well so Let's just go here with the blue color. I think I need to select these multiple uh, icons here to change the color of this all together. So I'm going to actually go into the text. This is going to be the blue color. And same goes for this background. So we're going to have the blue color as well. And we're going to do the same thing on this. So this is going to be the dark blue shared. This one is going to be the lighter one. So I'm going to pick this up. I'm going to make this a bit lighter version of it. And we're going to do the same thing on this one as well. So let's just change the color of this. So we're going to go more lighter version of this. I think now this is looking perfect. Now in the similar way what we can do here. We can actually change the image if we wanted to. So I think I'm going to change the image here. So we're going to go here into the elements. We're going to search down real estate. Let's say building. I think that would be it. We can search into the photos. Alright, so it should not be the empire. It should be building only. Perfect. So I think I would go here with this one. I'm going to simply drag this. I'm going to put this here. And this is looking great. What else we can do? We can also add the color onto that. So that it should match the theme of it. So we'll simply add the rectangle here. So we're going to search for rectangle. And what we're going to do, we're going to put this as per our size. Perfect. And now what we need to do, we need to go into the position. We need to go into the layers. And now I need to put this uh, before our image. And now what we need to do, we need to go into the transparency. I would decrease the value here. I'm going to decrease the value to the 50%. Now we are actually matching the theme that we have on our booklet. And now what we can do, we can simply copy the style. So I'm going to simply copy this. I'm going to click on copy style. I'm going to put this on this. And now we actually have to do the same thing on these other options. On this uh, box as well and then also on the text. Obviously on the text, we need to update the text as per our requirement. And after this, all we need to do is to change the color theme. Obviously if you want to change the background image as well, you can also do this. But if you don't want to change anything of that, what you would need to do after that, you just need to change the colors of it and you need to add your own details into this. And this is how you can make a booklet in the Canva. So if you really find this video useful, 
hit the like button and subscribe the channel